We go back to Burke Field here at Morristown Beer for the nightcap of the boys girls doubleheader. And it's Selena Ladon with the blast that goes wide for Parsippany and we have no school. Then it's Haley Pignatelli of Parsippany with a long free kick. The Morristown goalie Lizzie Sangle plays it clean as Selena Ladon comes barreling in for the Red Hawks. The Crimson look to break into the scoring column here. Watch Juliet Pike with the blast, but it just goes wide and we still have no score. Then watch Danny Cabot of Morristown Beer with a couple of nice moves before she launches the blast high over the net in this scoreless clash. And the half comes in an end with no score. Watch Lizzie Sengel scoop up the loose ball for Morristown Beer. We move the second half action and it's Danny Cabot with a long free kick that is flicked on goal, but Varsity goalie Daniela Spiller is there to make the stop for the Red Hawks. And then it's Haley Pignatelli of Parsippany again with the long boot on goal. But once again, Lizzie Sangle is there for the easy stop for Morristown Beard. And this game is still scoreless. Now watch Danny Cabot of Morristown Beard send in the nice chip, but it goes wide. And we're midway through the second half. We still have no score in this defensive battle. And then it's Parsippany goalie Daniela Spiller with another stop here for the Red Hawks, with just under 12 minutes remaining in regulation. Will this game go to overtime? No, because watch Morristown Beard on the corner kick go to the give and go, and Danny Cabot's shot makes its way through for the goal as the Crimson would hold on for the 1-0 victory over the Red Hawks. It was just great having the whole team together and we were working together, and it definitely helped. Like We knew that we needed to play good and shut them down right away and play uh, and pass in the midfield and get that ball moving and definitely try and look for our corners because it was such a big field and we were used to playing on a smaller field so we knew we needed to spread it out and then close it in when they had possession. It took a lot of perseverance uh, over the course of the night. We, um, we struggled for most of the game to really create chances. Uh, they play with a deep sweeper, um, uh, something that we've not really seen uh, this season. Um, because of that, we struggled to get behind them. Uh, they defended well, um, but uh, in the end, you know, we, uh, we created a few things from what we've been working on in the training ground and we got the goal from that. Danny, you had the main goal, the big one. Talk about it. What did it take? Well, it took a lot of perse perseverance on everyone's part. We were shooting the entire time. They just weren't falling. And we practiced this corner kick, um, a two-man run, and she would dribble down to the uh, end line and cut it back to me. And I just hit it as hard as I could on the ground because I knew it was very slippery. So I hit it as hard as I could, and it just bounced and bounced and bounced when it was the best feeling ever.